Hello again, everybody, and welcome to East Coast Capers Plays Blood on the Clock Tower. I'm Skipper Steve, and today will be the second video in Mayor Week. Today we are going to be playing a script called Get Down, Mr. Mayor, given to us, thankfully, by Viva La Sam. Thank you so much, Viva La Sam. The script looks absolutely amazing. I've never played it. I've never run it. So let's see what kind of crazy we can get into. Uh... There's one thing that I looked at right away, and I'm I'm trying to decide. Do I want to leap into a meta, or do I want to really avoid it? What's obvious is this. I love Psychopath. <laughs> but it's not because I love Psychopath so much that I want to put the Psychopath in the game. It's that I really want to see this happen. <laughs> If you don't pay attention to what's on the script, this is actually my line of thought. If you're not paying attention to the um, to the script itself, you almost kind of deserve to get hosed by it. And if the psychopath just comes right out swinging, pretty sure I know who the preacher's going to pick that night. <laughs> Assuming they don't kill the preacher. Um, so that I think would be really fun. The other thing is, this also has my favorite demon on the script. <laughs> The Poe, because I like a lot of deaths. However, it can be mitigated. Um, if we did something like pop... Where did you go? Where's the innkeeper? If we did an innkeeper, a soldier, and a fool, that could really confuse the heck out of the um, out of the Poe. I don't. If we don't put a poisoner in the game, then there's no way for them to contend with the soldier. Which I'm actually okay with. Um, if we put a godfather in the game, that could, if they communicate, that could really help. Yeah, Gollum Psych was awesome. <laughs> You're right, Jackie, that's a really fun one. But then it's, an, it's in, like an instant ender, right? The psycho kills, and then the Gollum kills the psycho, and then that whole situation is over. But it is really neat. Uh, yeah, so I was leaning. I don't, I'm not really leaning anything. Uh, Serenovus is what I'm seeing. DA, okay. Um, yeah, Godfather, that's the other thing, too. It could do three outsiders. I don't think I'm going to do Gollum. I think I'm going to, I want to see this psychopath preacher thing play out. I want to try to find something a little bit unique. Uh, so I think we're going to do mutant. Oh, you know what? We could make the drunk. We could make the soldier drunk. We'll hold on to that. Tinker? Yeah. That's fine. Those would be the, our base, too. If we. If we decide that we want to do Godfather, then I think we make somebody drunk. I think we would go that route. We've just got to see what kind of game... I think I'm not going to do DA, so we've taken that off the board. <laughs> um, do Godfather? Do Saranovis? <laughs> Pixie, Preacher, and Granny. Ooh, let's entertain that. Let's do Godfather. We'll add a drunk. So Pixie, well, Preacher's already in there. So Pixie and Granny, what would that look like? What else would we, oh, Magician. Should we do a Magician? Oh, wait, no. We have to put Mayor in. <laughs> um, we could make the Mayor the Drunk. That might be fun. Hmm. Or, yeah, or mayor is a bluff. Or, like, just put the mayor in, right? Like, see if they can get it. The mayor would have to avoid the psychopath. Oh, I kind of like that. That's a big challenge. Yeah, get down, Mr. Mayor. So, yeah, may we're going to have a legit mayor to try and dodge that psychopath. And he's got help from the preacher. I like the way this is shaping up. Um, so now we just have to choose who we're going to make drunk and why. I'm also looking at the rules. There's not a lot for them to learn with what's in this game. So I think I might take Grandmother. Well, let me take Pixie off and give him... Should we give him a fortune teller or a magician? Yeah, Drunk Fool is kind of fun. <laughs> that would be neat. Um, I think we give him a fortune teller. Yeah, I think fortune teller is helpful. Now I just got to decide, do I really want to do the soldier thing? 
Um, or do we shift it? Because if we give them... I'm, I'm trying to balance this as much as I can. I was just thinking, if I take Soldier out and I put Gossip in, that could be rough. <laughs> that could be really rough. Drunk Grandma is funny, but only funny... I don't know, for a moment, I guess. Uh, they usually... Figure that out. Let's just see where these go. Okay. Let's begin our night phase. Okay, so we got JP as our Poe, Emma as our godfather, Hungry as our psychopath. <laughs> okay. Um, let's do... Who do we want to make be drunk? I could... I mean... I just petitioned to put Fortune Teller in the game to help them, and now I'm thinking about making Fortune Teller drunk. <laughs> uh, you know, I think I might just do that. I think I may just see how it goes. Because I can tell them the truth, even though they're the drunk. I think I'm going to do it. No, I, want, I don't want to do Drunk Preacher. I, I really want to see this... Uh, never do this, by the way. As a storyteller, never decide what you want to see because it almost will guarantee not happen. <laughs> but I really want to see Hungry come out swinging and off somebody and then get Preacher frozen and see if they can figure out who that Preacher is. Um, do the Drunk Innkeeper thing. Oh. Yeah, I think that could help. Okay. Or drunk, you want drunk soldier? Alright, you guys are all over the board. <laughs> Let's do... I'm gonna drunk the soldier, not because they need the help, but because it could sell a poison world. That's what I'm gonna do. Alright, now, let's get to this. Hello, Hello, hungry. Hello again. <laughs> Steve, I love you. Steve, I just love you. I, I cannot stress this enough. I just love you. I just love you. <laughs> well, the feelings That's mutual, cool. my friend. Uh, make the loss proud and handle that axe with care. I'm here to let you know that Emma is your fellow minion. Yes. And JP yes. is your demon. I love Emma and JP together. I love, yes, please. Yes, please. Thank you so much. You got it. See you in the morning. I will kill them all. I will kill them all, chat. <laughs> <laughs> like you. But... Hello, hey, Emma. Steve, how's it going? Uh, it is going. Um, I'm here to let you know that your fellow minion is hungry. Okay. And your demon is JP. Okay. And while I'm here, I'm going to let you know that there are a tinker, a mutant, and a drunk in play. Tanker, mutant. Yep. Okay, so JP's Poe then. Yeah, JP has to be the Poe. Perfect. Cool. All right. Thank you. We'll see you in the morning. I hear you. <laughs> this is that level. Yeah, you got to get. The unlock is 10 million hoots throughout your lifetime. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, JP. Hello. <laughs> you are the best demon. <laughs> yes, and I'm definitely not the lunatic this time, so. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm here to let you know that your dirty little ne'er do wells are Emma and Hungry. All righty. And your bluffs are going to be Pixie, Gossip. And philosopher. Okay. Sounds good. See you tomorrow. See ya. Mostly it's 
new people who I haven't talked to and given them my usual first discussion spiel. New people. You know I do greeting things and silly things. I was going to say hungry. Yes, Ronan does cut the you people promos fairly often. Yes. Oh, I love this. You <laughs> I, I did say new people, not you people. It, like, it, still oh, sounded yeah. like you, people. it sounded like you said you people. <laughs> what did he say? What did he say other than that? I heard you. I said oh. there's several new people, and you know oh, I go you people. give them Sorry. my spiel, greeting and spiel. New yes, you me people. people. <laughs> As a general reminder, I'm to blame for Yumi even being a thing. <laughs> Hello, Neko! Hello! Please choose Welcome two back. players to gaze into your crystal ball at. I'm gonna choose my neighbors, JP and Christine. Alright, you choose JP and Christine and learn that, yes, one of them is the demon. Beautiful. Thank you! You got it! Take your corpse around. That was the reason why I was thinking about drunking the fortune teller because it's a very typical situation where they just check their neighbors. <laughs> so we'll see. <laughs> Two, with how much overtime you put in, yes, I am convinced sometimes that you were a corpse. Um, we have to pick a grandchild. I wanted to, to do the preacher. Um... Yeah. Speaking of fortune teller, let's make Andy our... Oh, wait a minute. Let's make Christine the red herring. If she goes that way and gets a yes, she might leave. <laughs> like leave the JP rap for a little while. Else. Ah, preacher pick. He picks JP. Got it. Okay. So technically, uh, for those of you who are following along, this is a little bit more of an, an advanced script. I've gone out of order. Um, I opened up the possibility to make an error, which would have been uh, if Luxray chose Emma, Emma would not have learned the Outsiders. Um, so if you encounter this as a storyteller, don't do what I just did. Because um, it's risky, obviously. We gotta pick a, a grandchild. I, you know, I'm kind of leaning towards showing them the mayor. Because it also protects the grandmother. You know, mayor bounce. <laughs> uh, and I think that's it. Yeah, that should cover everything. Let's go tell Jules. Oh, amazing! <laughs> okay. So, somebody was using a hand while Steve was. Yellow. Hello, Jules. I am here to let you know that your sweet grandchild is Sabinite. And Sabinite is the mayor. Cool. Thank you. You got it. <laughs> All right. Someone's looking for a jump. Marking it on Fingo. Got it. I love it. Good morning, <laughs> Ravenswood Bluff! Once again, your illustrious storyteller has died, and this can only mean one thing, and that is there is a demon amongst you! Please go find out who it is. You've got seven minutes on day one. Yay. I just want to start this off by saying that I blame Sean for all the losses that, are, that have happened in the last game. It's definitely uh -huh. not me coordinating. I, uh -huh. I did not fail at anything. I chose the most perfect. Thank you, Gamer Girl Astrid, for gifting all those subs. I, wow. Team Hungry. That's all I'm going to yeah, say. Yeah, let's go. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> all right, Hungry. What do you want to talk about this game? <laughs> Honestly, um, you're you're my you're my first conversation. I'll just tell you this. I. Um, I am either the farmer or the tinker. I'm not gonna, you'll know if I'm a tinker basically. I'm either gonna explode or I'm just gonna be brought to other people at this point. Uh, so Love just that. keep this in mind. Yeah. Okay. I'm either, I'm either a farmer or a tinker. That's it. That's all I'm gonna say. All right. I will give you either Philo or Fortune Teller. Philo or Fortune Teller. I love that for you. All right. Philo, Good Philo luck and Yay. goodbye. Thank you, Christine. 
I I am either the grandmother, the gossip, or the tinker. So if you want to innkeep me, if you're the innkeeper, that's probably fun. Cool, cool, cool. I'll keep that in mind. All right, thanks. See ya. Well, <laughs> don't. <laughs> I mean, you can. But, no, I mean, you know. I can if it's useful to you. You want to roll swap? I don't know if it's Not useful to you. Not super much? I don't see how it's useful to me. My plan is just to sort of sit back, relax, help you people go and scare the thing you would have jumped into me. Yeah. And then, you know, in a few days, punch someone and see what happens. I mean, just wait on a psycho, wait out a psychopath. That's another good, yeah. good use of it. Yeah, but like, do I really need to kill the psychopath? I mean, I'd rather kill someone who might punch someone who might be a demon. Yeah, to see that's if fair. A demon. Just eliminate down until we get to until we get to the point where there's no. Because no the thing about down. the psychopath is, if we can manage it, it's not the worst deal. Like, yeah, but there's not a lot of information on, on the. Yeah, there's not a lot of information on the script that the psychopath can really disrupt. There's the mayor, fortune, fortune teller, teller, mayor, gossip, I guess, but like gossip sort of. If with the psychopath, psychopath killing the gossip, gossip is yeah. basically the same thing as the gossip killing someone with the gossip ability. It confirms a yep. good player at the cost of a life. Like, yep. Ooh. Yeah, I'm so, I'm wait. I'm more interested in waiting until we have demon candidates, making sure I don't hit like fools or something or sailors who. Yeah. Yeah, cool. I think that's a good choice. Mm -hmm. Bye. All right, bye. Bo, oh, I'm not evil. You're evil. What, what lies do you want to tell me today, Hungry? Oh, you want me to lie to you? Okay, fine. I will lie to you. I will tell you I'm either a godfather, a poisoner, a devil's advocate, a Saranovas, or a psychopath. Okay, so I you're a minion. Gotcha. I lied to you. I lied to you, yes. Okay, okay, cool. Um, I, I will lie. Uh, I'll lie to you, too. I'll tell you I'm an outsider. <gasps> How dare you lie to me. Okay, bye, Hungry. You're giving me four different roles. So. <laughs> there you go. Oh, that's right. That's how you would know that. Fair enough. Yeah, because I know the outsider count, so I know you can't be a thing. Um, cool. All right, cool. Uh, uh, I'm telling people in the golem. Don't Alrighty. come to me. Bye. <laughs> bye. Hi, to Yumi. No. <laughs> what are you, Yumi? I'm a sailor, fool, or innkeeper, Hungry. Would you like sailor, to be drank with, supposedly? Uh, ooh, that's actually... Hmm, if you want to drink with me... Wait, did you say sailor, fool, innkeeper? Yes. Okay, um, I, actually, I don't mind being drunk with if you want. Okay. Uh, if you have no better targets, I can go for that. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll just keep it at that, I think. I think. I'm stuck in a private chat the entire time. <laughs> I love computer issues. This is why I went into computer stuff. Yeah, <laughs> no. <laughs> Sounds fun for you. You're basically getting to do your real job on your mm, weekends. No, that see, I, I'm letting fun. Sabonite fix it for me. He gave me a solution. Yeah. Okay. Uh, well, anyway, what do you <laughs> want to do, Walter? I'm just going to hard claim. I'm the preacher. You're the preacher? Yep. Cool. Uh, I'm the golem. Cool. Have fun with that, I guess. I know you like the gold. Yeah. I want Ronan and oh, who did I talk to first? Why did I not write that down? Or maybe it's just Emma and Ronan. Mm -hmm. Um, but nobody's bid on anything yet, so Okay, I'll mark you down as the magician or potentially maybe evil trying to find your evil team, which is also a oh, possibility. That's, that's totally fair. Um, yeah, um I'm... that's fine. I'll tell you that I'm either the farmer or the mayor. Alright, cool. Farmer or the mayor. Yep. All right. Cool. All right. Cool. I'll see you in town. Yep. Thank you. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Chat was pulling for you. <laughs> you know, the puzzle master got me dead. My rights, though. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Yeah. And everyone knew you were just gonna get, get mad at hungry. So you know, good stuff. Good stuff. Um, what are you this game, Yumi? Uh, I am either a sailor, a fool, or an innkeeper. Okay. Sailor. Cool. Innkeeper. <clears throat> if you are any of the drunken abilities, I um, am an information gathering role, so just let me know so that I can know whether to trust my information or not. Cool beans. Uh, there right. are some people that have told me that they're fine with being uh, either drunken and or drunken protected, so I'll 
probably lean towards them so that you Love get that. good information. It says philosopher on it. Oh, fun. Mm -hmm. Philosopher. Okay, I will tell you that I, I am also a good girl and mm -hmm. also have a blue token. I am either the farmer or the mayor. The farmer or the mayor. Well, I have great news for you. I either phyloed into farmer or have not used it. Okay, cool. It's so, fine. Yep. Yep. Okay, cool. Bye. Bye. Oh, well, I hope you're the philo. Why is that? Are you the um, gossip? I'm not. I'm not a big fan of the gossip. How? Oh, gotcha. uh, I will give you tinker or fool. Tinker or fool. Okay. Good to know. Yep. I, I refreshed so many times. Today. And we're back. <laughs> and we're back. We're, we, we have a stray back save and I didn't to appear. All right, welcome back, everybody. I will give you guys one minute to talk openly amongst yourselves before we open up noms for day one. Um, I, I hungry would like to try something. Um, uh -huh. I would just like to announce something to the town, and let's see what what happens. Hungry, hungry would like to claim farmer and shoots a rake towards Yumi. <laughs> what? I don't think that's how that works. <laughs> did, did something happen? Nope, that's that's not a function. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll try something else. Hungry claims Tinker and boings uh, a wrench on Yumi's head. That's also <laughs> not a thing. <laughs> Let me oh, try no. one final thing. Oh, Hungry oh, claims Psychopath and shoots Yumi. <laughs> Hungry claims Psychopath and kills Yumi who dies. <laughs> oh no. Stop you, Hungry! <laughs> what, what's the joke? I I'm know. a Tinker! Oh. Oh. <laughs> Liar. You're a fan dude. Well, interesting. Well, well, thank you for reducing well. my stress levels for free. Now my poke can kill comfortably. <laughs> I'm done. With that, nominations are open. Uh, and the nominates hungry. Oh. Andy nominates hungry. Please tell us why. Uh, I'm the godfather, hungry, I'm gonna pick paper. <laughs> <laughs> hungry, your defense. Um, well, I'm clearly the drunk because my other weapons didn't work. So I should not be dying. Thank you. All right, six votes are required to put hungry on the block. I feel like it's more profitable to execute the uh, godfather claim. Yeah. <laughs> Ba, ba, da, ba. I'm just really happy about this symmetry, so thank you, Town. <laughs> You're welcome, Christine. I, I would have Six voted, but I'm dead, and I don't want to do that yet. Second call for nominations. Milk would like to gossip. Milk would like to gossip that the demon is exactly one of JP, Jules, or Luxray. Gossiper? Uh, Saban um, would like to gossip that Luxray, Neko, and Ronin are all good. Gossip heard? JP oh. would like to gossip that the demon is on the cardinal points. Gossip heard? Uh, Neko would like to gossip that there's a godfather in play. Gossip heard? And Christine. the gossip stairs. Go ahead, Christine. Uh, Christine would like to gossip that there is not a farmer in play. Gossip heard? And Look. the gossips that there are no evils uh, set in, still next to each other. Gossip heard? Luxray gossips that Hungry is not the psychopath. Gossip heard? Love you, Luxray. Second call for noms. Milk nominates. Mm. Milk nominates. Ronin. Milk nominates Ronin. Please tell us why. Mm. Ronin's a sussy baka. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. Ronan, your defense. I am perfectly fine with this. All <laughs> right. Seven votes are required to put Ronan on the block. Six to tie. I will 
vote myself to break a tie. Oh no, I didn't think we were gonna get this many. Oh, Just like Sussy Baka. Why are we I'm, lifting the psychopath? I'm not worth it, I'm not worth it. <laughs> oh no. That <laughs> seems you, odd. Seven is enough. Oh, yeah. really? The psychopath isn't the demon, Emma. Yeah, as we true. as we discussed in our conversation, the psychopath. We discussed. Yeah. yeah, that's true. But Boy, final call for now. I mean, I guess I'm not the worst trustworthy either. I can be just evil with. with them. I'd like to get rid of all the places that the Fangu can jump to, in my opinion. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely Fangu game. All right. If there are no more noms, I'll bring the day to a close and set. I'm the drunk. Early death for me? Okay, then. Well, we wanted you to be able to join your minion. <laughs> <laughs> Ronin is executed and dies. Uh, it's also a good call, because if there's a godfather, I only trigger once. Good night, everybody. Sorry, Ronan, it was really obvious. Hello. Hello, X-Ray. I will be choosing Hungry. All right, Hungry it is. Thank you very much. <laughs> I mean, I gave you the flag for two different possibilities. Yeah, yeah, I think we were yeah. good. I, I'm, I'm, yes. Hello. Hello, Hungry. Hello. I am here to let you know that you are now attending the most mesmerizing sermon of your life. Oh no. <laughs> I've been preached. <laughs> I forgot about the preacher. <laughs> I forgot about the preacher. I was so convinced that there's a golem or something. <laughs> oh no. Have fun. Wait. So wait, wait. does that mean that means I cannot use my ability whatsoever, right? Uh, it means... Until, until the preacher dies. Basically. Yes. Ah, fine. Yep. I'll cause chaos. So. <laughs> <laughs> More. <laughs> Thank you, Steve. You got it. Yeah, my last two conversations of yesterday, no one could hear me. So. I'm sure yeah. you'll be busy tomorrow, Milk, but uh, day three we'll talk again. No, I mean, you have all my, you have all my info now. Hello, Andy. Hello, hello. Who would you like to protect tonight? Uh, my neighbors, please. Luxray and Hungry. All right. Luxray and Hungry it is. We'll see you tomorrow. Thank you. It's... <laughs> I don't even know what to do with this. All right. If I drunk the preacher, then we continue to let the psychopath kill. Should we do that? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Or do we just let it be and drunk the psychopath? It kind of, it's so weird. Drunk, the, everybody wants drunk preacher. All right. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> so if hungry, <laughs> he might not even say anything because he's been told he was at a sermon, but now uh, if he does say, hey, I claim psychopath and kill so-and-so, what if he tries to kill the demon? <laughs> oh my god, that'd be amazing. Ooh. Hello, JP. Hello. Would you like to use it, or would you like to charge? Oh, it's, uh... A bit of a tricky one because I'm thinking I'm probably gonna charge because Emma should be able to kill and then psychopaths can kill somebody else and so it'd be sort of nice to kill three people. So yeah, I'll charge. Okay, charging up. See you tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Preacher or golem, really? Yeah. Well, if you look at oh uh, yeah, Andy. Hello, Emma. Hello. How's it going? Going great. Who's gonna get the stab tonight? I'd be saying. Ah, Luxray. Okay, Luxray it is. See you tomorrow. Sorry. I knew that was coming. Oh, 
<laughs> so Lux Race, wait a minute, yeah, Lux Race not gonna die. <laughs> no deaths. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> ah, and there's no tinker for us to cover with either. That's awesome. All right, let's see. What else could go wrong? Um, oh, nothing. We just got to go see that fortune teller and see what happens. <laughs> I'm hungry wood psychopathy. Like the, the joke setup was good, you know. It was oh, no, very, it's fine. This likely. is... Look, it, it's, did, it's payback for... Hello, Hello Neko. I am going to choose Christine and Milk, please. All right, you choose Christine and Milk and learn that, yes, one of them is the demon. Cool. Thank you. You got it. No. It was your fault to me. So this is interesting, and I'm really glad that I hung the red herring on Christine. Because now that Neko's gone that way, she might tomorrow night check JP and Jules and get a yes. But even if that's the case, I think Neko's going to convince herself that she's drunk. <laughs> that is fun. Um, all right. So... The psychopath is technically no longer at a sermon because the preacher is drunk and no one died. Let's tell them. I'm Rowing probably going to crash for a nap afterward. <laughs> Good morning, Ravenswood Bluff. It is a particularly bright morning as no one has died. Huh. Was hmm. That was odd. Interesting. I can't Interesting. imagine why that would have happened. Yeah, I can't imagine. <laughs> I promised someone in the discussion, so <clears throat> I think. Like half of the rolls doesn't die yet now. <laughs> Can and you hear me this time? Yeah. So much oh, cool. It's been very unpleasant if we had to play the entire game without being able to hear each other. Yeah. Well I could hear you, so yeah. it would have just been unpleasant for you. Well, you could have like tried to use like hand gestures to come. Yeah, I do have a whiteboard, so <laughs> Uh, what do you want to say, Pat? Whatever you want to do, Emma. Golem. Okay. Mayor. Okay. Alright. Cool. See ya. Yep. Bye. I know, I know, I know. It seems that Yumi died, but she's a tinker. Steve obviously took that and he re he killed her because he knows that I was Sarah Matt as a psychopath. It's entirely possible that that yes. happened, but how would you know that Yumi is the tinker to select she, Yumi? Obviously, she told me. She told ah, me. so if and I go uh, ask her if she told you, she'll say she yes, told you. 100%. Oh, okay. That's good. That's good. She, look, she insinuated it. <laughs> oh, she insinuated it. Fascinating. Okay. Yes. Sarah well, Madness is no joke, no. It's no joke. Sarah, it's not a joke, no. It's a very, a very important. Uh, it's a very important thing to follow along with. 100%. However, that said, you read so evil. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I, don't, I just don't know. So I, don't understand. I don't understand what you're talking about. Look, I was just you're, welcome, you're welcome to choppy choppy me. I'm still a philosopher, so look, no look, big deal. Look, the thinker says you might die at any time. Steve is obviously an evil storyteller, and he decided to get die at any time. the thinker out. I'm just, you know, please and that makes you look like a psychopath, which means yeah. that no, you know, no, 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 we don't use these words when no, we no, don't. No. When we don't, no psychopaths are roll. Thank you. No, 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 no. <laughs> no. The fortune teller or the golem. All right, so fire lower FP. Okay, fine. I guess I'm yep. giving you a two. Mm -hmm. Okay, goodbye, Walter. Hi. Yeah. So. It's just how, well, it's a it's a matter of how likely are they to be coming out or if it's a hidden drunk somewhere that we have to look for. And that's considering we have two roles on the script that can also make people drunk potentially if they're in play. Yeah, so we have... We have a hard ro way, uh, a hard road to follow to try and figure out whether or not there is basically any of the last four because we haven't heard anyone being mad, but we wouldn't know yeah. that they're mad. Uh, although I was not mad, so I'm pretty sure Milk picked up on that. Mm. Hi, Steve. Hi, chat, by the way. Hi, hi. For those of you who are unaware, Yumi is my real-life minion, apparently. 
<laughs> you can thank uh, chat. You can thank Steve for 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 that. By the way, <laughs> everybody needs minions. I've been uh, apologizing people uh, for not thinking about that interaction. Uh, if you are a sad goal, I'm sorry. I uh, I prevented the golem to nominate. On, uh, the oh, uh, don't worry about it. I'm the golem, and I was never nominated. So like that. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna nominate demon candidate at the opportune moment. Okay. So you, I'm one of the most suspicious. Why are you art claiming to? Okay. Okay. If you're the thing you Don't jump to yeah. me. You're the innkeeper. Yeah. Ooh, who'd you protect last night? Lux Young hungry. <laughs> That's funny. All right. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Gossip or preacher? Gossip or preacher. So if you're the preacher, I, I suspect you probably pick hungry. Correct. I mean, yeah. Okay, cool. Then if I gossiped, I also gossiped about hungry because I did. So that is true. Um, I'll tell you if I'm the fortune teller, uh, we should maybe look at Christine. Interesting, because Christine also claimed fortune teller. Oh, that's fun. Mm-hmm. Okay, you, should, cool. you should, should work that out. Yeah, we probably should. All right, good luck. Yep, thanks. It told me if I were evil, but I'm not. Yeah, I, I didn't think about that. Um, I so I'll just I'll just instead of climbing claiming file a grandmother, I'll just say grandmother, and then that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. But uh, yeah, I think uh, there was something else. Um, right. So you so you could have been targeted by if there was a Godfather that her talk about. Like, yep, I could have absorbed a you. shot. For sure. If I die today, then we would know that. But I'm not right. in a hurry to die. I think hungry might swing at me. That's true. All right. Oh, good luck. Bye. See ya. Thank you. Bye. The role that I told you that you were. Oh, so the the one that okay, the one that I put you down as. Sure. <laughs> yeah. That doesn't matter to me at all. The one where you gave me three, and I said no. I'm just going to say that you're the fool. Yeah. <laughs> And I said, no, I'm not the fool. <laughs> All right. No, it's already marked. Bad. There's a grandmother that saw you as the fool. Okay, um, sure. Are you the innkeeper or the preacher? Maybe. Okay. <laughs> Sounds good. I <laughs> not know what's about to happen. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, this is amazing. Uh, <laughs> Alright, welcome back everybody. You guys have another minute to talk over the amongst yourselves before we open up noms for day two. Public public service announcement. I was made Sarah mad as the psychopath yesterday. Of course, Yumi was the thinker. We all knew she's the thinker. Steve, being an evil storyteller, saw that she was a thinker and saw me as being Sarah mad as a psychopath. Decided to kill Yumi because a thinker can die at any time, guys. I am not the psychopath and I will prove it. I will prove it. Hungry claims psychopath and shoots Neko. Hungry claims psychopath and kills Neko, who dies. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> um, <laughs> yes, absolutely. There's more than one wow. tanker on the script. Hungry, don't worry. Yeah, yes, don't worry, guys. There's multiple tankers. I was the, I was the oh. Philo who went tanker last night. Oh, wow. Just for fun. <laughs> That's so our, I don't know what I expected to happen there. <laughs> yeah. um, actually, I have some interesting information, there. potentially. Um, I was actually the fortune teller. Mm. And I got two yeses, which means I, maybe I'm drunk. That's possible. Uh, but the first night I checked JP and Christine and got a yes. And the second night I checked Christine and Milk and got a yes. So do with that what you will. Okay. That would make Emma sense. nominates Christine. Emma nominates Christine. Please tell us why. Okay, let's kill Christine. Christine, your defense. Emma, I told you were the only one I told the truth this game. <laughs> this is fine. We can kill me. I'm going to die. I may have prevented a death last night. They're not going to do it again. All right. Five votes are required to put Christine on the block.
Uh, I mean, did you lie to me? Nope. Sure okay. glad you didn't pick me. Barb. <laughs> 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 season up. Christine is barred for execution. The second call for nominations. Christine I don't know would how like this to happened. nominate Luxray, please. Christine nominates Luxray. Please tell us why. Um, the first two he gave me was Sailor and Fool. I said, wow, that sounds like a great test. And he said, never mind, just kidding. And then he gave me two <laughs> other roles, one of which was a preacher. And I said, oh, so you pre- you uh, you chose Hungry, right? And he said, absolutely. So all of those were lies. All right. That's all. Luxray, your defense. I will say that I re- redacted my first two before Christine could make any statements. So I did notice that was an issue. And as for the preacher... Uh, thing I have been told I was inkept by a certain player who will rena- remain nameless, but uh, it's their fault. <laughs> All right. I wonder who it is. <laughs> <laughs> Six votes are required to put Luxor on the block. Five to tie. Uh, sorry, Luxor. Yeah, I yes, sorry, don't like Luxray. you tonight. You're going on form. <laughs> Ouch. Nobody's voting. Why did everyone put this? Two is not enough. Oh, no. Final call for nominations. Yeah, this is tragic in a sad I mean, yeah, we know way. What's happening here? It's so sad. It's unfortunate. I mean, I hope we're wrong, but it's the same. Yeah. Um, I'm All right. So if there are no more noms, I'll bring the day to a close in 10. Third minion, want to panic for him? Uh, oh, and Christine is ha- <clears throat> is executed and dies. And congratulations, the game continues. Oh, thank Oops, I guess I lied to you, Satan. <laughs> no, that's fine. Okay. <laughs> guess we kill Emma then. I agree. Yeah. Hello, Lex Ray. Hi. I mean, I know I'm dying, but I'm picking Hungry. Okay. Hungry it is. Yep. Uh, Golem. Oh. Emma, I told you the truth. I'm the Golem. I don't know what... (laughs) Hello, Hungry! (laughs) Uh, Hello! I'm here to remind you once again that Uh, you have ever had a mesmerizing sermon. (laughs) Today, today I today I will prove myself yet again. <laughs> Looking forward to it, brother. Looking forward to it. <laughs> you would have to be the red herring. Yeah. Hello, Andy. Hello, hello. Who would you uh, like to protect tonight? Jules and Saber Knight, please. All right, Jules and Saber Knight. It is. We'll see you tomorrow. Thank you. Also because uh, of other things. Other things? No. A thousand mm. betrayals, Emma. A thousand betrayals. <laughs> mm. I'm just the golem. I'm pretty sure the game's over and Steve's just having a, having a hoot and a holler. Hello, JP. Hello. All right. Who's it going to be? In what order? Yeah, this is going to be a tough. I, I think this is going to be a tough one to win, based on some things that I don't know if Chat saw, because I told uh, Milk that I saw my grandchild with Emma. I didn't say what though, at least. But ooh, okay. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna go because um, I have no idea what anybody is. I'll go with uh, Milk and then Sabanite and then Jules. Milk, Sabanite, Jules. All right. Yep. See you in the morning. all right so milk loses a life save a night we can bounce jewels will not oh wait no 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 we well we could but no that's wow that's amazing No, 
bouncing because of protection? Uh, let me double check. They can't die. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. Can't bounce. So, zero deaths from the Poe. Let's hope Emma takes out that innkeeper. Because <laughs> they killed the drunk. <laughs> Demon, you probably should. Hello. Hello, Emma. Please choose a player. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> How exciting. Oh, no. The problem is, I think JP probably charged. Oh, that's rough. Um, if we co if I get this right, uh, Jules might be the fool. So I'll just hit Jules and hope that either JP didn't hit him or he. I'm going through his second life. Hopefully, JP needs to kill Abby. Oh. And Buck, sorry. Gosh, those were important. Go. Thank you. Bye. So, Jules? Jules, yeah. Okay. Not yesterday. I was still ceremonial. Crazy how that works. I know, right? The Sarah Novus can't make people mad as evil characters. Emma! This is so crazy. I honestly don't know how I feel about this, but <laughs> I don't understand why Emma didn't kill the innkeeper. <laughs> Thank you, Serendipity, for the gifting the sub. Oh my gosh. Yeah, like either one, you could have taken the innkeeper or the preacher down. <laughs> I don't think JP knows who they are. This is amazing. Well done, Andy. You are the all-star for the good team right now. This is so great. And now Hungry can't kill. Okay, here we go. Good morning, Ravenswood Bluff. It's another bright, shiny day because no one died last night. Oh, what? Wild. Sounds good to me. What? Intriguing. Demon, demon why wouldn't you target me? Oh, is it because Christine was already dead? That's true. <laughs> uh, well, hungry. Yay! Right. Possible. Because there's no godfather kills from the outsiders who died. If there was a poisoner, they wouldn't need to Thanks, shout out who the innkeeper was. And it doesn't feel like a Serenovus. So it feels like it's a DA and we're just going to waste our time bouncing off Emma. I don't... Yeah, I don't know. But um, it could also be a double bluff. I, I think so. I think Emma could I think Emma could be either the DA or the poisoner. Um... In theory, you wouldn't necessarily shout out the innkeeper, but I'm not sure. Okay. I'm the fool. Cool. So. Yeah. I could have absorbed oh. a kill. I may not have absorbed a kill. I'm not really sure. Who knows? Right. Okay. Gotcha. Okay. Yep. Thank you. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Interesting. What? I mean, it should have worked after the first time you preached it. I, like I said, I was in kept supposedly. Oh God, innkeeper. Great. So, I mean, is it drunk on the script? Drunk is on uh, the script. I could just be the drunk. Maybe. I no longer know what to think. In that regard. Oh well. Hi, Steve. Hello. Hi, Steve. Can I offer right, you? I'm gonna a go back in these trying times. Sure. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm gonna go back to having my head hurt and trying yep, to figure it out. Yeah, sounds good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I have no idea what is happening. But um, okay, um, have you heard of any other outsiders besides you and Ronan? No. Okay. Well, so most likely not a Fangu, or I guess it could be Fangu and Godfather minus one to even it out, but. Okay, it's, po it's possible because it's like the other route to take is that if there is an extra outsider in the game, um, then it's a drunk. That's the yeah. only thing that I can think of. Because um, it's yeah, like it's either it's either Fangu, Godfather, or both. It there nobody's been dying, so either yeah. all of the protected targets just keep getting hit, and people just don't know when to. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, that one could also have been a poacher. But I feel like a poacher, they would have at least hit one person. Who no, see, died. Ronan thought that as well. But then I'm just like, why would so many people stay alive? Like, there's a part of me that's just, this is not me trying to meta anybody. I really suck yeah. at meta metaing anything. But part of me is just like, I'm a tinker. I can help make worlds look like other worlds, but I died so early. So what yeah. does that make everything look like? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I, I agree. We, we did kill both of the outsiders, too. Uh, at least two of them. So if if the demon has to find a hidden drunk, that might be difficult. Uh, yeah. But yeah. Okay. All right, well, let, let's try to talk to some other people. But Yes. Thank you. They were like they would have known maybe that Emma was bluffing that or something. Yeah, I guess that's bad enough claim that it's believable. <laughs> so right. as an evil, you probably wouldn't claim that. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thank you, JP. All right. Cool. Oh. Yeah, it's secret. Uh. Oh, preacher does go first. Okay. Yep. Preacher goes before poisoner. Yep. I'll try preaching Emma tomorrow, and then we'll preach hungry. I mean. If the innkeeper's not drinking you... Oh, they drank you last night. They protected you last night, then. Last night? Or the night before? Well, if they didn't protect you last night, then whoever you preached isn't going to have an ability. Supposedly. So. If Emma's the poisoner, I still wouldn't have an ability. Okay. Right? Because that's... I'm gonna. I'm too tired for this. I the announce they would know. That Look, they I'm happy to kill anybody freed. but Emma and Hungry at this point. Basically, like killing them seems like a waste of time. Yeah, fair enough. Let's. Yeah, same. Um. If you know anyone who you could convince to nominate. Yeah, because I mean, if we all think <sighs> Emma makes too convenient people... a target, and that's why she's having fun. I'd actually think maybe we go after JP out of that info. Yeah. Uh, for uh, Steve in chat, um, I just told Ronan that JP told me that he was the grandmother who saw Emma as the golem. And that didn't match what he told me day one. Yeah. At all. And I don't trust that chain because I don't trust Emma. Right. So, I mean, JP could have been hit with the poisoner if we, or hit with poison if we do have a poisoner. But, um, like you said, if we had a poisoner, someone probably would have died because of you know, poisoning there would have been enough coordination or something so all right i'm gonna um try to see if i can get a hold of milk good luck okay goodbye elsewhere oh okay okay that makes sense that makes sense okay cool um yeah just a fortune teller okay but but, but that makes sense because i didn't i didn't tell you the truth Anyway. The other reason is that the grandmother wakes pretty late at night, and I woke up real fast afterwards, so I didn't think there was room for a fortune teller at the end. But Steve might have gone out of order. He's yeah. Steve do that. Yeah. Okay. No, that that makes sense. Um, yeah, I was just wondering because right after that conversation, I was like, why did he just automatically assume I was the farmer? I was like, I was trying to figure out why you why you thought that. Yeah. <laughs> okay. That was cool. it. Yeah. Thank no you. Worries. <laughs> Welcome back, everybody. You guys have another minute to talk openly amongst yourselves before we open up noms for day three. I will prove myself yet again that oh, no. I was Sarah Mad as the psychopath. Uh, Neko was the file thinker and Yumi was the thinker, so obviously Steve, being the evil storyteller, killed both of them. I will prove it yet again. Hungry claims psychopath and shoots Luxray. Hungry claims psychopath and kills Luxray, who does not die. See, I'm I'm just good. I'm just yeah, good. this makes sense. Good job, Luxray. Okay. <laughs> Thanks. What a surprise. <laughs> Is it? Time to get hungry off the block. No, oh, no, no, so it's a reason to waste we, we are just not wasting time. No, we're not going to bother with hungry or Emma. Okay. We'll kill. We'll kill someone who is them, and it's probably not Luxray because hungry just tried to kill Luxray. Yeah. I appreciate the, uh, you know, the help, hungry, making me look more innocent. You're welcome, Luxray. Yeah, best minion. Yeah. Um. I mean, anybody have a thought between... Well, I mean, obviously I'm in the remaining people, but I know I'm good. But... Uh, I've been told that there are whispers that JP is supporting Emma. 
She is. I am not supporting. I, I have talked to people. About yeah, mechanically. That. Yeah. Okay. That's not. That's not what you claim to me. Yeah. Well, I. I I, just, I believe that. That's fine. I mean, I think it happened in town. Makes me think that I'm either the drunk or was poisoned or something because it doesn't make sense. It, it also could be that JP just was the was the yes, and maybe milk is my red herring. Milk red herring, and JP is demon. It could be any combination of those those three for my fortune teller pink. So, or I could be drunk. Yeah. Does anybody else have any other info that's useful? Steve, um, nominations open? Yep. Yeah. Alright, Luxray nominates JP. Luxray nominates JP, please tell us why. I pass the accusation to Neko. Neko! Um, I have two remaining fortune teller guesses if Tal wants to go for it. Um, I'm not, I'm not going to waste my dead vote uh, this early, but... Uh, I think it, it could be an option. Do, do what you want. All right. JP, your defense. I mean, the, the two oh, yeses okay. are Christine's in both of them, which makes you think just red herring. I know I'm good. I pretty much trust milk. I don't think my information is any good, so it is what it is. But... All right. Four votes are required to put JP on the block. I mean, I've also been told JP's in a double claim. I'd like to know who that came from. I remember when demons didn't get into double claims. That was a good time. <laughs> Four <laughs> votes is enough. JP is marked for execution. Second call for gnomes. JP nominates Sabonite. JP nominates Sabonite. Please tell us why. Uh, if the double claim is Philo, there's somebody around the circle who knows why that's not a double claim. But if it's something else, then I'd love to hear about it. All right. Save a night. Your defense. Uh, it's something else, but also apparently you're mechanically confirming Emma, who... I mean... Nah. <laughs> Yeah, but it's fine. We can run it. Alright, five votes are required to put Save on the block. Four to tie. If the double player oh, concerned about it, it's Philo, I'm not Philo. No, it's not Philo. Okay. Because that's that was my role, but okay. so double claim doesn't really if it's not a Philo double claim, then it's somebody claiming the role that maybe they're drunk now. I don't know. Final call for noms. Hungry nominates hungry. <laughs> 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 hungry nominates hungry. Please tell us why. You know, I've heard that I get to play Rochambeau with the, with a the storyteller this way, and I think I think Steve, you have been an evil storyteller, killing the tinkers and the Philo tinker. So I want to play with you. I want to see what happens. Okay, five votes are required to put Hungry on the block for a tie. So I mean, the execution is part of your ability, and it's clearly not working. Yeah, it's not gonna work. <laughs> <laughs> hey, leave you me alone. Would just die. <laughs> All right. What is that enough? If there are no more noms, I'll bring the day to close in ten. JP is executed and dies. And congratulations, Sabonite, Mr. Mayor, and the good team. Ooh. Good job, you guys. <laughs> Yay, we did it. <laughs> I'm sorry, Unfortunate. <laughs> oh, that was a rough, rough That was game. brutal. <laughs> it started out so fun, too, because on day one, we had Hungry, the not-psychopath. <laughs> Swing and kill Yumi, the tinker. <laughs> and for that activity, the town decided to execute Ronan, the mutant. That night, Andy, your innkeeper, your all star for the game, decided to protect Luxray, your preacher, and Hungry, your psychopath. 
Clearly, the preacher was drunk. (laughs) (laughs) That night, (laughs) JP or Poe decided to charge, um, and Emma, your godfather, attacked Luxray the preacher, who was in keeper protected and did not die. Oh Thank you, my goodness. <laughs> oh, it gets better. <laughs> the following day, the town decided to execute Christine, the drunk soldier wow. red herring. <laughs> wow. That's a lot of tokens. <laughs> it was a lot of tokens. <laughs> and that night, Andy, your innkeeper, decided to protect Sabanite, your mayor. And Jules, your grandmother, who saw Sabanite as the mayor. Wow. The fully charged Poe decided to attack Milk the Fool for the first time, who lost their first life. Sabanite the mayor, who is innkeeper protected. And Jules oh the grandmother, god, who is also they? innkeeper protected. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ. Yeah, oh, and we're not done yet. Andy, because Christine the drunk died, giving Emma the opportunity to make a kill, who chose Jules, the innkeeper protected grandmother. No! <laughs> no! Beautiful. Jeez! And everyone woke up and decided to kill JP the Poe. Neko was, in fact, your fortune teller who, on night one, got a yes between her red hair and Christine and. JP the Poe. And that was your game of Get so, Down, Mr. I wanna, Mayor. Wow. I want to say a couple of things. So at one point, Emma comes to me and she says, what are you doing? Like, I tried to kill her. <laughs> 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 Who's hungry? I, the I, only one that killed that game. Yes. <laughs> and, and, then, and then like I, I decided oh to do Philo Grandmother. So I go to Milk and I was like, yeah, I'm the Philo. And I'm going to yeah, turn to the, I'm going to, you know, turn to the grandmother or whatever. And he goes, oh, cool, I'll just, um, you know, I'll, I'll just keep saying that I'm the Philo. I'm like, oh, that's fine. That's cool. So then I decided, I was like, I don't know anybody's role, so I know that Emma's bluffing Golem, so I'll just say I saw Emma. And then the very next day, oh, Emma nominates. I'm like, oh, no, <laughs> this is going to be so bad for me. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like yeah. the hot sauce packets on the other hand now. <laughs> I... I chose only evil players. I chose JP and then Hungry twice. Wow. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, what a game. Well, I hope you guys really enjoyed that game. For everybody who's here with us live, thank you so much for being here live and engaging with us. Thank you guys so much for the subs today. You guys have been absolutely amazing. And if you're watching this back on YouTube and you enjoyed the content, please consider giving the video a like. But more importantly, If you like helping people, then please consider subscribing to the channel so that we can put that YouTube algorithm to work to go and find other people like yourselves to enjoy this content.